You ever find yourself in a situation where you feel like you have to force things, like you have to make things happen, like you have to literally will something into existence or happening. Uh, if you're like me, you've probably experienced that sometimes where you feel like I, I have to make this happen. I got to do this. Here's the interesting thing. When we are trying to force something to happen instead of just kind of letting it happen on its own or giving it time to kind of um, to kind of uh, materialize in the in the natural, you're going to find that a lot of times we end up fighting against ourselves or pushing people away because we're so goal oriented or so driven to accomplish whatever we're looking for. With horses, when we're trying to teach them to lead and we're, let's get this thing out of his mouth, when we're trying to get my horse to lead forward, if I just pull on my horse, look at how hard it is for me to move him, right? Like I really just yanked and pulled and it took a lot, okay? But watch, if I just kind of give him some direction and I hold my hand out there and I'm just consistent and persistent, look at how much easier that is in order to get him to move in the direction that I'm asking him to move in. So whether it's a goal, whether it's something you're trying to attain, whether it's something you're moving towards, don't spend your every waking hour just fighting with yourself, trying to figure out how you're going to will it to happen. Just trust God, right? Like get into the motion, start to ask, be where he wants you to be and just wait for things to fall in place. Because if you stick with it, then you're going to get that motion. You're going to get that movement. You're going to get that progress that you've been looking for.